I am going to do a about a series on beauty supply store hair and how like the naming of their changing of their package is not really what it is and I wanted to show you but first I don't have any makeup on because I just did errands today and I didn't need to wear makeup to do errands also my hair needs a wash so it's in a puff yeah so the first one because I'm gonna do two hair brands but the first one I'm gonna show you is this one and they said this is Brazilian body wave the color I have is 1b blue and purple I decided to grab blue and purple because it was blue and purple but you can get it solid and other. so it comes in a package like this you get three bundles and a closure I have a 12 I mean a 22 a 20 and a 16 and the closure top is a that's a 16 I mean 18 and the closure top is an 18 so I'm gonna just take the take the 22 off so this is how the 22 looks First thing I notice about the 22 is it's not as full as you will get if it's very actually real virgin hair because this is like nothing. So I'm going to take the tags and I'm going to open it. See if I can get it to open. There we go. And I'm going to cut this little white thing off. Okay. So this is, is as much as hair on the 22 as possible. I am messing this up because I did not unravel this right, but whatever. Okay, whatever. So, it's about, it's about long. I messed that part up because I didn't unravel it right. But yeah. Let's see if I can untangle this. There we go. And so yeah, that's how the hair looks. The webs are very, very, very thin, you guys. Like, see, these are very thin webs. Like, yeah. And I will say, if you would buy this pack of hair and you want a full look, I would say buy two. And this hair costs about $14, so yeah, I say buy two. I only bought one because I just wanted to get one. So this is the 22. And then this is 20. This is 18. And then this is the closure. So this is what the closure look like. It's a top closure. I don't know if I'm going to use the closure. I so I was, I was saying, you can see the tracks in the closure, and then this, it's how much hair that just fell out the closure. So yeah, um, I wouldn't suggest washing this. On the packet it says to wash it, but I wouldn't suggest to wash this because of how it is. It's not really actual human hair. It's more of synthetic hair. But if you used to washing synthetic hair, I say go ahead and wash your synthetic hair. But I'm not an expert on washing synthetic hair. I've never washed synthetic hair before. So yeah. But I do like how they did the coloring job where it's it's really good ombre they did I'm gonna show you on here like the ombre job is done very well on this hair 
in person the purple looks like a real brightish pinky purple and then on camera it looks like a deep purple and the blue actually actually look like a purple in real life but on camera it actually look like a real blue so I will make this into a wig I don't know what type of wig I'm gonna make this into but I'm gonna make it into a wig and I'll post pictures in the video but this package does say the flanner and the hair so I'm gonna use the closure and I am just gonna flanner and show you so this hair does get a bit straight so this hair does get straight Ooh, but it's hot. So, I would say you can use heat tools on it. I don't think you would want to use, like, stove tools on this hair. But you can use, like, a flat iron, a curling wand, or curler. One of those that you can get from the regular store. Instead of, like, a stove tool because I think that would just burn this hair. But it gets, it gets straight. It gets really straight. So, I see you guys later. And with an update on how this hair worked. Um, I hope you like the video. Subscribe, comment below, and follow me on Instagram at promise underscore T93. And follow me on Twitter at promise M triplet. My last name is spelled T R I P L E T. Alright, bye.